So this is the uh, In-N-Out Burger scooter seat. Um, it'll only work with an In-N-Out Burger t-shirt. I've tried it with all of their extra large t-shirts and it just doesn't seem to work on this black bike. So looks good on there I think. Anyway, so long story short is the uh, creation of this uh, marvelous scooter seat repair uh, is I filed for a patent um, is patent pending and uh, I plan to release this scooter seat uh, to the general public after patenting it as my uh, gift to humanity <laughs> Basically, you take the arms, twist them up really tight, uh, get the rubber band over it a couple times. Seems to hold it pretty well. Maybe there's something better than rubber bands. Maybe those broccoli bands or something like that. A little more surface area, but those get nice and tight. Um, you just want to be able to uh, make sure where this latch goes. That is, you know, all up around there. So. When you close it, you could tape it up there. Uh, I'm just really careful when I close it, so. Um, on mine, at least, you're gonna have to have some room up here. Um, and then your ergonomics around here and the seat molding are gonna vary independently. So you gotta find a place for this. This knot is kind of bulky. And if you put it down here, seems to want to like super flex the seat and that's not good so uh, yeah basically you just you know put the neck over it um, and bring everything in like that and bam you got a seat you're in business um, let's set it down here Pull this back to where there's some space. Damn, it's locked. And uh, I want to undo it. I'll take this and then I'll push down on the seat a little bit. I'll push down on the seat a little bit and then turn the key. So lengthen the latch life. It'll probably pop up just depending on how big your knot is and where your knot is, but yeah. Enjoy America. Scooter seat. Done right.